What's up, everybody? All right, so I'm gonna try and figure out where to put you guys so you can, there we go. Kind of see, maybe, like that, perfect. All right, so in preparation for the garage move, um, I wanna cover the sunroof, but I'm planning to do some form of either fiberglass or carbon cover. And one way people do that is with spray foam and then molding it. So we have some tape. I'm gonna put you all in time lapse. I'm gonna tape this essentially shut. Um, this lower section, the first thing I'm going to do is run a, an edge all the way around uh, to keep it from sticking to the body. And then I will tape across this stuff in here. And then I have a can of spray foam. It's kind of excessive looking at the depth of this. If I had done the one inch stuff, it would have been fine. But it should expand up to three inches, which cover this no problem. Um, I might need to put something up in here. I have cardboard paper. Let's, let's do that. We'll duct tape the cardboard paper. Kind of like this. To at least minimize it from... Oops, we'll minimize it from drooping in too much. Uh, and then I'll duct tape across it. And I'll push it against it. And then we'll spray foam it. And then I'll run to Walmart and get the right battery because I bought the wrong battery for the side-by-side. -side. So I need to go get a different one because then we're going to come back and I'm going to use the side-by-side -side to move the lawnmower out. And then I'll roll red out. I'll roll all of my stuff probably out of the garage temporarily. Um, and then I'll put the lawnmower back in, in the back corner of the garage. I'll move all of my stuff to the front of the garage. So tomorrow when I show up with the truck and trailer, it's just a quick, easy swap. So let's get time lapse. Okay, so apparently I didn't grab enough of that foam. But we'll let this sit and hopefully harden. It's a little chilly in here today. Um, and I gotta go switch out the battery. So when we come back, I will try to finish that up. So I'll go around, we'll show you the other side because obviously this side's kind of covered. So you can see the goal is to have it level and or above the hood or the roof. So I can foam, uh, sand it and everything. That's to try and expand out some of the spots, but getting there. <sighs> Hefty. All right, guys, it is Saturday. This appears. to a fully set, but it also didn't work. So, yeah. A for effort, uh, a Z for execution, because this didn't work even remotely like I was planning to. So, like that inside still mushy, um, which is weird because we're at almost 24 hours. Anywho, uh, the side-by-side, -side, which I didn't really bring you guys along for the ride on fixing that, um, needed a battery, bought a battery, and then spent the rest of the day diagging a fuel pump. It's a mechanical vacuum driven fuel pump and it's trash. So I have an electric one coming in today. Once that's in, I'll be able to, uh, utilize the side-by-side removing stuff because the uh, <clears throat> excuse me the lawnmower also needs a battery and the carb is like not the best on that so it's kind of a struggle to move it around it's kind of big so I need the side by side to be able to move it and then it'll help me with unloading and loading the trailer so Unfortunately, I think we might end up 
pushing into tomorrow. Um, just picking all this stuff that didn't work up off. Um, yeah, so I think the probability is we're going to end up pushing into tomorrow. Um, I also have a friend giving today. So, yeah. Lots, of, I was planning to have a lot done today, but with having an unknown ETA on the fuel pump for the side-by-side, -side, I don't know when I'll have that running, so I don't know when I'll be able to move stuff around. I wanted to have everything rearranged yesterday. Um, that was my original goal, but you know, the, the original thought was the side-by-side -side just needed the, the battery. And I went and bought a battery, but unfortunately, other stuff happens. Yeah, this, this, I love that it's just peeling right off of this. That would have made life super easy, but <clears throat> these would be this. Um, so yeah, I will uh, probably edit most of this extra crap out, but I mean, this is, this is where I'm at. This is what I'm doing. Ugh. Ugh. It should be dry. 24 hours, it should be freaking hard. It's not. So that's part of the problem. It's probably because of the temperature in here. It's a little chilly. <laughs>